new from the South Bay tonight. San Jose police identified the person arrested in connection to a weekend fight inside a restaurant. 30 year old Brian Carter is accused of bringing a gun to the fight. The incident also led to a police officer shooting a college athlete. And tonight that man's attorney tells Crown Force Zeke Medune his client is a hero. Keon is a hero. You know, Mr. Green is a hero. You know, he is a person who himself was threatened, attacked, battered, uh, forced to defend himself against not one person, but three people. And in the midst of all of that was then threatened with a gun. That is how attorney Adante Pointer views what happened to his client, Keon Green, a 20 year old Contra Costa college football player who was shot by San Jose police over the weekend as he appeared to be backing his way out of a violent brawl inside of a restaurant. At the time, Keon Green had a gun in his possession that Pointer says his client disarmed from someone else during the fight. It appears to me that at the time Keon is actually backing out of this restaurant, the police are just getting there and they're running up to the restaurant, a group of police officers. And when the door starts to open up, they stop. Two seconds later, less than that, there's gunshots and Keon is Mr. Green is hit. We're still looking into where he was shot. Uh, yeah, it looks like on the video that it was his back was towards us. But um, again, that's something we have to take a look at. Pointer says only one of the officers firing a gun is an important factor in this case. He was overreacting to what he saw in front of him. None of the other officers did fire a single shot. So, you know, that means that that just means that that officer's conduct was that much more unreasonable. After being shot multiple times and hospitalized, Pointer updates the medical condition of his client. He was struck in his abdomen uh, two times and uh, once in his arm and once in his leg. Uh, he is set to hopefully be released from the hospital uh, sometime, maybe today or tomorrow, uh, but he will be just moving to another uh, rehabilitation facility. Hazik Madyun, Cron for News.